So you can see how the floating road cover is pulled to the side on a couple of the beds. Uh, the one in the middle actually just had a um, floating road cover pulled to the side on that, but I've just pulled it back after harvesting from the bed. Um, it's a technique that I've learned this year um, as I was wondering how on earth I was going to deal with potentially continuing to harvest with this rather thick row cover on top of it, floating row cover, which can damage the plants if you really start moving it around too much. Anyways, I took, lifted up a piece of the row cover to take a look at the plants underneath and shazam, a new technique revealed itself to me for basically pulling the floating row cover back and then going along and harvesting. It's working very well as a process. Once done, we'll pull the floating row cover back over the plants, <coughs> like that blanket, to cover them through the night. I'm also, at the same time, pulling out um, leaves uh, and plants that look potentially as though they might be threatening in terms of uh, getting funky and diseasy. So, as we're harvesting very heavily on this bed, we are cleaning it constantly. This is this um, fundamental axiom, you hear me repeat time after time after time, which is that the act of harvest is the act of stewardship. And you can see that these plants are looking healthy and happy, um, in part, obviously, because they're doing an amazing job, but also in part because we're consciously and actively stewarding them through this whole process. Now I've left the um, um, floating row cover pulled back because one of the things I noticed was that one of our particular crops was beginning to look potentially as though it was too damp under the covers and there was a little bit of dampness and wetness. So I'm pulling the covers back to let the plants dry out for a couple of hours and then once that's done, I'll pull the covers back for the night.